never too late for a career change late. This week, Ségolène Royal. Remember her, the former partner of François Hollande. She was a French presidential candidate, beaten by Mr. Sarkozy. She was made French ambassador to the Arctic and the Antarctic. I think President Macron is trying to tell us something. It's going to mean a lot of traveling between the two embassies and some pretty lonely diplomatic parties. I do hope the penguins like Ferrero Rocher. Maybe we should send Choo Choo and AJ to keep her company. That would be the caring thing to do, especially since waiting in the wings is philosopher Slavoj Gizek here to put sensitivity in our spotlight. So don't you dare face blub, wipe your Twitter tears away, and get snapped chirpy on the Instagram. Now, we have a confession, folks. We've been lying to you for years. You see, nothing you ever see in this program is original. Simply put, we purloin other people's ideas and use them as our own. Our terrible story treatments are lifted from Newsnight. Our appalling jokes from the Rochdale Herald. Or at least I'm told that's the case. I don't know where it is. But we're not the only ones living on borrowed ideas. The Jack Doe epidemic has reached as high as the Cabinet. It would seem some in team may have been pinching policies from the Labour Party manifesto. Plagiarism for the many, not the few. 